Hello, Mr. Tenke here, number 686, holiday edition number two. Dear management, too many companies miss many of the benefits of analytics when applying ratios. They simply feed it numbers in, see if the outcome falls within an industry guideline, and when they do, they continue on their merry way. But see, that right there is where they miss the boat. Here, let me demonstrate. Um, and this is a, a simple ratio that many of you fishermen might be acquainted with, okay? This is a fish, excuse my artistic inability. Um, this, is, this axis is the size of the fish. And this axis over here is actually the number of beer cans or beer or whatever, bottles, drink, so beer. Now, this, um, so yes, it's a simple analysis to the number of beers drank to the size of the fish told in the stories by that fisherman. Usually it's kind of that race, that, that kind of analysis. Um, so well, yeah, while this is funny, I hope my point will ring clear. And mainly that point being is to please stop using industry standards as the end all be all of whether the comp your company is doing a good job or not, or from which to make decisions upon because ratios are only meaningful and produce constructive results when you fully understand the mechanisms um, that impact them and are impacted by them. So yes, this ratio is simple, but only when it's applied like an industry standard and blanketed across all fishermen. But if you look a little deeper into these factors, um, it can be a valuable tool and constructive. So for example, uh, first of all, the beer cans it could be bottles, could be, and there could be different sizes. And a lot of beers have different alcohol content, a variable overlooked when thinking uniformly. Um, and not all fishermen drink the same amount. So, you know, how drunk a fisherman do you want to listen to if you want to get the story of where the best fishing hole is? And not all fishing holes produce the same catches. Um, some are more stocked than others. Um, different fish are more available at different times of the year. Um, spring Chinook, for example, and so on and so on. From this simple ratio, um, so you, you have to look at the details and the data behind it because then you really can find out what you're looking for. Um, and maybe to drive this point home, <laughs> uh, I'll leave you with this question. If your company is trying to catch the best volume of fish or loans, are you going to listen to the stories told by some drunk fisherman? Or are you going to dive a little deeper and listen to the stories of the data, which is screaming for you to hear? And those are my couple pennies. Have a good day, peeps.